It's Ariel from Librarian's Bookshelf with this week's In My Mailbox and Stacking the Shelves. So last week on the title of my actual blog post I added Stacking the Shelves, uh, whereas in the video I didn't. So the reason behind that is originally when I did it in my mailbox, it was hosted by Christy the Story Siren um, and she had the linky. So basically, you know, I'd be able to check out new blogs, they could check out mine, and I was able to meet new people that way. Um, since she no longer has a blog, there isn't linky going on anymore. Um, and a couple of years ago, Tinga of Tinga's Reviews created Stacking the Shelves, which is basically the same thing. Um, it's just her version, and she has a linky. So I decided to start linking up with that just so that I could um, be able to meet new blogs and have new people follow my blog and kind of just connect with more people. So I will be linking up with her and mentioning both in my posts. If I say in my mailbox or if I say Stacking the Shelves, I do mean the same thing. Um, I'm probably going to use them interchangeably for a while, but I am going to be using both in both my posts and linking up to Stacking the Shelves. So, I only got uh, a couple of books this week. So first, for review, I got Heart Sisters by Natalie Chambers Snap. Um, this is a blog tour I'm doing for LitViews, and I did start a little bit of it, as you can see. Um, not very much, but already I can tell I'm going to love this book. I'm super excited to read it. Um, so that one, I want to say it's like the 17th or the 21st or something is when my post is due up. Um, so be watching with that. It'll be within the next week and a half if that one is due. Up, um, so I'll be posting that one. Um, that was the only review book this week. I did buy a book this week. I got some gift cards for Amazon, so I decided to buy a book. And so my all-time, 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 all-time favorite series ever is called The Edge Chronicles. And um, I believe last summer I reviewed the last book in the series, book ten, called The Immortals, which was a wrap-up of the previous nine books because it was three trilogies, and then the tenth one wrapped up all three trilogies. It was supposed to be the last one. But, there's an 11th one! So, I bought it. Um, it's called The Nameless One, Book One of the Cade Saga. Um, so, it's set in the Third Age of Flight, if you knew anything about the books. Um, so, it is set after the third trilogy. Um, I don't know much about it yet, but just looking at the pictures, the illustration, it's the same illustrator, same author. I'm just super excited. Um, book 12 is actually on pre-order right now on Amazon. Um, I don't know if I'll pre-order it. I mean, I'm going to get it eventually, obviously. Um, but I would like to read this one first. I will probably be reading this fairly soon once I get through some of my review books, just because I'm so excited about it. Um, it's a pretty big book, so it might take me a little bit, but um, I'm excited. I love this series. Go check it out. They're all amazing. Yeah. Uh, and this is the UK cover. They stopped making the US covers that my previous nine books are. So Immortals and this one have very similar covers. And the 12th one, which I don't know the title off the top of my head, will probably have the same cover, and the first nine will have the U.S. covers, um, which is kind of disappointing. I like having matching series, but um, they're all beautiful covers. So, yeah. And then, finally, these this book I half bought, half was gifted, kind of, sort of. So, for our premarital counseling, me and my fiancé are going through this book with our pastor. It's called Saving Your Marriage Before It Starts. Um, the reason I say it's half gifted, half bought is he bought it for us, but it's part of our premarital counseling fee. So, um, so we got the book and then the workbook for me and the workbook for him. Um, so we're going to be starting that not next week, probably the week after. Um, I don't know if I will be reviewing it on the blog. Um, probably, but I don't know yet. I haven't really decided. Uh, we'll see. Um, but that's all I got this week. I didn't get anything on Amazon eBooks this week. I don't know if I'll get anything this week in the mail. Maybe one review book, um, but if anything, it'll just be probably Amazon books next week. Uh, I know I said I was going to do social media Saturday yesterday, and it didn't happen. It's been kind of a busy weekend and a long, hard week at work. Um, I am going to try and do it oops, computer um, this week for sure. I'm going to try and work on that today and, well, today being Saturday. I'm recording this on Saturday. Um, and tomorrow, Sunday, um, when I work on the reviews for this coming week as well, uh, so yeah, so be watching for that, and that's all I got for this week. So if you've read any of these books, leave a comment down below with what you think, and if you want me to check out your video, leave a link, and I'll be happy to. Thanks guys, and have a great week.